Wolverine is one of the X-Men and probably the most famous one. He has adamantium coated on his bones with six retractable claws and a healing factor that heals almost any wound and also keeps him young which also makes his age pretty damn near impossible to work out from looking at him, as he barely seems to age at all. He has uncharted regenerative capability, which enables him to heal rapidly. This also makes his age impossible to determine. He could very well be older than you, Professor. And a lot of people have been asking me, what is his age in each of the movies? Since the X-Men movies do jump around throughout history, it makes it quite hard to determine because there is not a linear pattern. So here is his age in all of the films. Firstly in the order of Wolverine getting older, then after I'll quickly recap his age for the films in the order that the films were released in. We start with Wolverine's birth in the year 1832. We then skip to the beginning of the film X-Men Origins Wolverine, in which Wolverine starts out in 1845 as a 13 year old boy. After this Wolverine and his brother Victor fight in several wars and God alone knows how many battles. One of these wars is the American Civil War, which took place from 1861 to 1865. This means Wolverine is 29 at the beginning of the American Civil War and 33 at the end of the war. The next war is the First World War in 1917 to 1918, meaning he's 85 at the beginning of the war and 86 at the end of it. Next he fights on the D-Day invasion in 1944. He is 112 here. Then we fast forward to the year 1945 in the film The Wolverine, in which Wolverine is in Nagasaki, Japan, getting blasted by a nuke. Here he is 113 years old. Next we go to 1962 for the X-Men First Class film, in which Charles Xavier and Magneto meet him briefly in a bar. He is 132 years old here. Next we flash forward to 1973 in the film X-Men Days of Future Past, in which Wolverine travels into the body of his young self. His young self is in the year 1973, meaning he is 141 years old. Next we go back to 1974 in the X-Men Origins Wolverine film again. Victor Creed has killed a senior officer and as Wolverine defends him the two are sentenced to death but can't be killed as they both have healing factors and are instead recruited by William Stryker for his team of mutants. Putting together a special team with special privileges. Wolverine is 142 at this point. A year later, in 1975, Wolverine quits the team. He is 143 here. We skip to 1979 and Wolverine is living as a lumberjack. Though through a lot of tragic events, he loses his lover, gets his bones coated in the metal adamantium and then loses his memory. He is 147 at this point. Next we go to 1983 in X-Men Apocalypse, in which Wolverine is 151 years old. Then we see Wolverine in 2003 in both the first X-Men film and the second X-Men film, X2 X-Men United. Here he is 171. We jump to 2006 for the film X-Men The Last Stand and Wolverine is 174. Then we go to 2013 and back to the film The Wolverine in which Wolverine is living in the wilderness and then goes to Japan and ends up facing the Silver Samurai. Wolverine is 181 years old here. Next, in 2023, in the dystopian future of the film X-Men Days of Future Past, the old Wolverine, though he looks the same apart from a few grey hairs, is 191 years old. Then finally, in the year 2029 in the film Logan, Wolverine is 197, which is the age in which he dies. Now, all of that is probably a little confusing, so I'll quickly go back and recap all of his ages for all of the films, and these will be in the order that the films were released in. In the films X-Men and X2 X-Men United, he is 171. In the X-Men The Last Stand film, he is 174. In X-Men Origins Wolverine, he has several ages. As a kid, he is 13. With the Civil War, he is 29 when it starts and 33 when it ends. In the First World War, he is 85 when it starts and 86 when it ends. At the D-Day invasion, he is 112 years old. He joins William Triker's task force when he is 142 and quits when he's 143. His girlfriend dies, he gets out of Mantium and he loses his memories at the age of 147. In the film The Wolverine, when he is nuked he is 113 and for the rest of the film he's 181. In X-Men First Class, he's 132. In X-Men Days of Future Past, in the future as the old Wolverine he is 191 and as his young self he is 141. In X-Men Apocalypse he is 151 years old. And finally in Logan he is 197 years old which again is the age in which he dies. <sighs> Oh, so this is what it feels like. 
There is also the Deadpool films, which are, technically speaking, part of the X-Men timeline. Though Hugh Jackman as Wolverine doesn't feature in the first film, and that's the only one that's been released at the moment, so it's possible he's going to be in the future ones, but since he's retired as the character, it is unlikely. However, the first Deadpool film is set in the years 2014, 2015, and 2016, meaning that Wolverine would be, at this point, 182, 183, and 184, respectively. I hope that helps you all to understand his age during each of the films. If you think there's anything wrong with this list, please let us know in the comments. And a thank you to all of you who have donated to the Needle Mouse Productions page on Patreon. And for those of you who don't know, Patreon is a crowdfunding site that allows users to donate to creators in exchange for rewards. If you're interested, a link is in this video's description. And as always, thank you for watching and feel free to subscribe, share, like and comment.